Alright, we're doing more of this. Don't know how much more of this we're gonna do, but we're gonna do a little bit more. I'm gonna do Blug's Boiler. Because that sounds like fun. Um, I'm gonna be the good Yoshi, because Blake played the terrible Yoshi last time and just died. It was boring. Nobody cares. Eh. Uh, I'm just trying to beat this game quickly instead of doing it well. Bang! Right, oh, oh, God! Okay. There's their first attempt. I gotta say that the 3D graphics in this have not aged well. Not really, no. Um, I kinda like the really sick music in this one. Yeah, yeah. Whoa, whoa! It is whoa, 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 so yeah, we figured out that getting multiple in a row actually means nothing. That's just something our heads made up when we were kids. Maybe if you get them all one thing. Oh. Uh, I need to get it. Oh! No, not Blue Yoshi! I, I, I do find that to be uh, just an oddly evil looking place for a Mario game. Yeah, I mean really Bowser's Castle isn't that much more evil. Do you want to do the same course again, or do you want to do the other one? We've got one more to choose from here. Jelly Pipe, Blog's Boiler. We did Blog's Boiler, that's what I just did. Totally new level. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you mean Boring Yoshi? Yeah, Boring Yoshi. Alright. This level looks like it's going to start auto-scrolling. It does, isn't it? This is what, I mean... It... They start you off with pretty low HP. Um... Just because he just died. They want you to die a lot. This is like Death Souls. Dark Souls. <laughs> this, is the, this is the Dark Souls of Mario. Basically. I think that would actually be like... Um, what's it called? That game the, that's... the game we just played? Yeah. <laughs> that's the Dark Souls of Mario. Alright. Uh, there was something specific I was going to say and I totally just forgot it. Now that's all I'm going to be able to think about. That's a very strange fireball. It really is. But all the warping and stuff of that, it's like, it's just a little dated. Yeah. It's like, uh... Where do these bones come from? Uh, anyone... giant dinosaurs. Don't do that. Okay. Hey, what, were you scared? Are you scared now? Well, because if you die, we only have like three more lives to beat the game with. Ah, no problem. Oh yeah, I lost that. I wanted it. Hey, look, <laughs> there's no, um... Where's my, where's my, uh... It only went when you just recently ate. The, the so I have no idea. Where's all my fruit? I don't know. Well, maybe some, some glitchiness. Oh going. god. So yeah, we're playing in this kind of on a glitchy system, so... Hopefully that won't impede us too much! Just eat all the food, whatever. Fuck it. We can't see how much what the food we're getting is, so we won't be able to know until the little thing pops up telling us. Now, I just want to get through this very scary place. Yeah, the, the ramp up and scariness is quite high. <laughs> Yeah, from the first world, which is like... He was a puppy. Play with the puppy. Now play with the giant lava demons. Do <laughs> you want to go in the pipe? That's a very Yoshi's Island thing. Have a checkpoint and a pipe wait for it. They did that a lot in, like, Yoshi's Island. Yeah, I don't... I, I, I don't remember Yoshi's Island very explicitly. I do. I That's one of those yeah, few games... I keep of... almost jumping right in directly in the lava. That's I want to get out of this place. And you gotta eat a lot of fruit, Blake. It's the only. Way. I think this is trying to teach kids to eat fruit, which is wrong. Yeah. Children should not eat fruit. First of all, many fruits contain poisons. Yeah. They consider that they are poisoning children. Poison Nintendo, are you poisoning children? First, you tell them they can eat mushrooms. Now you can tell them they can eat. Just leave the banana, Blake. It's not. It's not worth it. Why did I ground? Oh, I should just use my tongue. <laughs> I forgot how to eat. Oh, hey, it's a chomp rock, kind of. Uh oh. Uh, that's. <laughs> the glitchiness is not coming oh, in. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we should not be playing it on this. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. Our actual cartridge is screwed up. <laughs> I'm really scared, but <laughs> I'm really. It's fine, it's fine. Just eat the fruit. Yay! Five more fruits so Yoshi can become happy. This game is really like manipulative, <laughs> and I it's don't... really passive aggressive in a weird way. 
I don't know what it is I'm standing on. Um, <laughs> what, what, what is this? There you go. <laughs> we I got some more eggs. I like how it's like it's like our gender neutral creature can collect these eggs and then just throw them at things and just kill them. Shoot them. So it's a mix of like a weird maternal thing and also a good patriarchal violence. Ultra violence. Boink. My favorite movie. Ultraviolet? No, ultra violence. Oh, okay. One more and we'll become happy, Blake. One more and we'll finally become happy! <laughs> get, get, you're still alive, Blake! I thought the lava was instant death. Nope. It was only last in this because I got stuck there. <gasps> Yay! Yay! We're having fun. We're, We're having, having a melange of fruits. Yoshi. Yoshi! That's my turn. Na, da, 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 da. You didn't eat many enemies, Blake. There aren't many enemies to eat there. Good old Yoshi. Oh, so for some reason I thought you when you walked off I assumed that you had ended the episode. I was like, you're only six minutes in. What's going on? Oh, I see you. At the page turned. An ocean of boiling hot lava bubbled out. Oh, if the Yoshis didn't cross, they would never find the super happy tree. Blog and the lava was scary. The Yoshis bravely fought their way through. This game really needs like you know multiplayer where you all play as different Yoshis all at once, so like eight players. That's what it looks like the the Woolly World looks a bit like. Basically, it's actually I was I was thinking it would be more Yoshi's Island, but it actually draws a lot from this game, like especially graphically and so sort of the style. Yeah. Cloud cruising, so tall tower. The, so the idea of this game is it tower. tells a different story depending on which levels you chose and. Uh, and there's one single story? Yeah, basically. So it, it's like uh, each playthrough you get a totally different storyline. Um, I can dig that. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> this has been a terrible mistake. You know the title of this episode? This has been a terrible mistake. Don't eat peppers. That's what I've learned from video games. Eat fruits, not peppers. The, the title of this whole series should be, um... Uh, Ow! Uh, glitchy Yoshi Run, or Yoshi, Basically. Yoshi Glitch... 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 Glitchy... Glitchy's gl itchy story. Gl glitchy... Glitchy's glory? Yeah, there you go. It's glory. We're playing glory. Attenza! Non è finita, mi senti? Non è finita! Uh. I do remember playing through this and getting, like, like everything. Yeah. But, How uh, did we do that when all we did was rent games? How were we that OCD about? Um, because we were kids. Okay. If my son played this, he would, like, get everything. Well, if your son played this, he would be if, standing in one spot for five minutes trying to figure out how the controls work. No, he wouldn't be trying to figure out how the controls work. He'd just be standing in one place saying, Oh, I'm not very good at this game. <laughs> my son's three, and he... And we, he's we not play, very good at video games. Well, we played video games with him a little bit. You know, he's three. We don't want to overdo the video thing when he's only when he's so young. Um, but we do let him play with us every once in a while. And if you watch long enough, you might just see a little bit of a three-year-old being punched in the face by a bunch of bikers. I hope not, because that would be wrong. But I'm just saying, you might... If there's you, all kinds of things... You, there's a chance at one point we'll just break. You know, if you watch us long enough, you might just see the heat death of the universe.